kick out. Jones can't mark. Manasseh across there to Atkinson in the forward pocket. Wait on it. It's a good kick. It's through. If you had the Medico number nine, Pink doubles back. He's caught it. Gets out of trouble beautifully. Looking for Manasseh. Collingwood by one point with Moore. He's been in the ruck, gets the tap down, looking for Weirmouth, but gets it on the second bounce to Oborn. Puts it wide, looking for Shaw. He can give it across to Manasseh. Manasseh from centre half forward, using his strength, shoots for goal, and he's dobbed it. Manasseh plays on, strikes off the tackle out to Atkinson. He gets a favourable bounce. He'll look for Carmen as he runs around the social club side of the ground. Across to Bond. He's a speech to this boy. In the centre half forward. Grossman. Ireland robs the ball. Good handball to Manasseh. Manasseh's kicked the centre wing. Carmen should mark. Barham. Barham at half forward. Kink unmarked. Sheedy closing. And Cloak emerges. His kick smothered. Kink can't handle it. It's a hand pass to Manasseh. Manasseh must hand pass. No, he gets past. And boots uh, up to the centre half forward. Oh, the fist of Burke. Back to Shaw. Shaw has Barham free on this side of the ground and sees him. Barham cuts inboard. And away he goes. He'll have a shot for goal. And bang it through. The goal of the difference. 16, 16, four goals, three now. It's the Collingwood lead over St Kilda, who were very disappointing until three quarter time. And they were trailing by 49 points. So they have fought back. They are now down 27 points. So they've picked up 22 points on Collingwood and to their credit they are fighting the game right out Ditterich and Thompson once again do battle and the man in front Thompson hand passes to Shaw Shaw got out of trouble nicely looked for a short pass you can see a teammate and Manasseh takes the mark plays on quickly a hand passes to Weirmouth Weirmouth from centre wing on the other side going toward the Wellington Road end goal a good kick doesn't get the where it was meant yes it does one goes goal with Paul Collingwood the kick drops short and the cross will go on quickly. It's just St Kilda can't afford to waste any time. Kick by loss, but it's a great mark by Billy Pickett. Bill Pickett at half back, taking a timely mark. The mark that will turn St Kilda out. He will drive as far as possible. Hopeful for a Rene Kink mark, I think. Or he may go toward the Bill Carmen, who's leading up the ground. He's headed toward Kink in the centre of the ground. Kink in front, got the hands which couldn't hold it. Taken by Atkinson. His hand pass comes out. An uh, opportunity for Manasseh. Manasseh putting Collingwood forward. The pass is good and accepted by Laurie Sandilands. Well, Sandilands doesn't seem to have an opponent this last few minutes of the game. St Kilda players, I said before, are trying to attack. They're forgetting about defending. And this kick by Sandilands. Fell for it. Pass is caught. Ireland takes it away from him. Free kick should go to Ireland. Ireland a hand pass across to Wayne Richardson. Down to Kink. Kink over his head, and you've got to come out, Max Pro. Manasseh beats him for it, kicks for goal and puts it through. <laughs> Collingwood are murdering them. Jason Romagli slips, a stupid mistake, intercepted by Folds and knocked away by Manasseh. Collingwood long into attack. Moore pushes his man in the back. Not and he'll kick the ball long for the Magpies. Great mark by Manasseh. Max Richardson's with it. Out nicely and hand passed, and here's another chance for Shaw. Shaw has plenty of time to steady and sends it down the in the Peter Moore direction. Moore a big leap from behind. Staying down was Brown. He's in a lot of trouble. That's Brian Brown tackled. Picked up once again, and here's a chance for Barham. Carlson. Carlson it is with his left foot. And a very good play. Shaw. Play. Manasseh away for the Magpies. Moore and Hanson. Moore from behind. Not good enough. Chance here for Shaw. Brian Brown is there. Dribble through cleverly by Shaw. And the Magpies looking good. Cleverly should mark. Can't mark in front. Not paid. Perry's there. Comes out to Magro and Perry who are fighting. But Magro will clear with a long hand pass to Manasseh. He'll give it to Weirmouth. No, he's caught with the ball. Dropping the ball. Oh, that's a ridiculous decision. Great tackle. And Manasseh's got the free kick. Bounced the ball when he was grabbed. That is an atrocious decision by umpire Nash. Downfield it goes. Worthing to the leaper. Brown is with him. Here comes Barham. Downfield it goes. David Mackay in front position. 
Well battled there, Stewart. Kink and great team player to Bond. Bond there looks for Peter Moore. On down towards Towns in the centre. Which way will the ball bounce? Ha uh, Towns went the moment across towards Armstrong, but intercepting is Manasseh. He's away. And will drive the Magpies right into attack. Southby taps it away. Nearly half time, McCormack. Big Moore and Pickett. Lee, a bit of height there, almost a skyscraper. Manasseh. Kane, but sure in front out nicely. That was well done. Max Richardson going past. Two man duel, Thompson and Leach. Thompson! The Tigers all but gone in 1978. Now, a game and a half outside the top five to with two rounds to play. MCG in the finals atmosphere with a big crowd to watch them and really uh, coming home strong. Ray Shaw with a long handball to Manasseh on the forward line. He tries for goal and it's there. Thompson gets the tap down to Tony Shaw. Geelong's misfortune opened the gate for St Kilda to jump up into the top five if they could upset Collingwood at Victoria Park. The Saints went in full of confidence on the back of a four-game winning streak. But history was against them, having won there only five times in 58 years. Today, marked by Michael Moncrief. Me, the Magpies badly need a goal. Not on the boundary line. And what's the result? It's coming around beautifully. What a beautiful... At the picket, Armstrong again. Morris is there, throws himself on top of the ball, scoops it out towards Barra. Here's trouble. Out towards Kink. He can kick as well, left foot as he can right. Down towards Carmen. Moore is there off the hands of the pack. Manasseh. Well, easy mark to judge. Tallest man in that area. Back to Duel. The kick was smothered brilliantly. Picked up by Carmen, who was kickless in that second quarter. Here goes Manasseh across the half forward line to Moore and Pennell right with him. Flicked away from the hands. Done his kick. Two goals. Three goals. And the Magpies answer back. Tricky done in the seam. Pounces on the ball with Southby hot in pursuit. Swerves away from Southby onto his left boot. Dead eye Dick straight through for his third goal. Phil Manasseh, half forward play. 23 minutes in the second quarter, and the Magpies had better get a rattle on if they want to be in this game by half time. Up towards Carmen, back into the pack, over the top. Done! That's his third goal. Max Richardson. Oh, off the boot of Wearmouth. Tackles uh, Nolan. away from Nolan, it's made the tackle a little bit better. He gets the fly over the mark. Montgomery. Vanessa Lovely, no support for the moment. Good play by Montgomery. They give him the free kick, no. Good play by Manessa. high tackle. And that was great play by those two players. Montgomery defensively, and Manessa, who had uh, possession of the ball, in front playing the ball got the free kick Collingwood trail by 15 points 13 minutes into this third quarter he's 55 meters out it's a floater offline